That's it, man. Game over, man. It's game over. Hello, everyone. Uh, I thought I'd just show you my uh, poker books, my collection of books. Um, I have uh, the two uh, Super System books by Doyle Bronson. Very nice books. Very uh, methodical and structured, and yeah, just teaches you solid play. Just really solid poker. Um, I'm not sure uh, with today's young players on the internet if they are still. I mean, they're still applicable, but. Today's game is so much faster, I suspect, than it was when these were written, but still very, very good books. Actually, the second book, the number two book here, was uh, was a version that was made because of internet uh, poker and the aggressiveness of the new players. So it's a bit uh, an adaptation. Uh, at least that's what I uh, understand, so correct me if I'm wrong. So uh, I have those two books, very nice books, read them both. Um, actually, I've only read the, the whole of the second one. I read half of the first one, so... But the second one is a really, really nice read. Um, and it has, uh, as you can see, different contribu contributors. Very nice. Superstars. Oh yeah. Uh, then I have uh, Phil Hillman's book, Play Poker Like the Pros. Um, I'll be honest, I only bought this book because uh, Phil Hillman uh, wrote it. Because I think he's, uh, he's uh, an awesome, funny guy. And uh, he's won a lot of stuff and you have to respect that. I uh, totally respect that. And uh, if I could be just uh, a percentage as uh, successful as he has been, uh, It'll be all of this would be totally worth it. Um, I read half of this book and then uh, studies just killed me. So, uh, but I definitely have to get back to it. It's a it's a good read also. Uh, I bought Gus Hansen's book um, because uh, I think the guy is awesome. I uh, I love him. He's from Denmark also, and he's um, he's a very nice aggressive player. The, the cool thing about Gus Hansen's book is that um, he goes through all of the important uh, hands uh, during the Aussie Millions tournament uh, from day one up uh, until the final table and it's uh, it's so nice because you get uh, to get in to get to uh, get inside his head and like what the stuff he's thinking about while the hand is on the way and uh, and uh, there's actually videos on YouTube where he's talking into a uh, some uh, recorder, <laughs> voice recorder. I think it was uh, in preparation for this book. Um, so yeah, it's really nice, and uh, I've learned a lot from uh, the way he's thinking. And um, definitely one of my favorite books. And then the the last book. Uh, that's actually the only book that I stopped reading after ten pages or something, twenty pages maybe, because. It's called the Mathematics of Poker. It's, uh, I have so much respect for the people that uh, that wrote this book, because I mean, but they are they are serious mathematics mathematicians. It's called. Um, so you really need to have a really in depth understanding of mathematics on a very very high level because it gets really really hairy. Um, we're not just talking. Uh, college mathematics or I mean this is university stuff at least and um, so yeah I um, I understood some of it but a lot of it I couldn't really comprehend so uh, I haven't really read it to the end so but um, so yeah these are my books and um, I can these three in particular I can recommend um, I think the first Super System book might be a little redundant, but it's nice to have for history because it was written a long time ago, so you can see the differences between, uh, uh, I think it's, uh, what, it's 20 years or something between the two books, or 15 or something. Uh, and, uh, yeah, and the, the books about uh, Gus Hansen is uh, interesting for what I said before. 
and the uh, Helmut's book is very nice and informative and yeah it's just it shows uh, and all of these books besides Gus Hansen's because that's what's like bound on a tournament that was no limit but super systems and Phil Helmut's uh, cover more than just no limit poker so uh, and I only know uh, no limit um, I played a little bit of limit but other than that I don't really know any of the other games and um, people have told me that you actually need to uh, try to uh, it's really nice to have a good understanding of the other games in like to help you get better at no limit uh, I'm not sure how that works but that's what they say so yeah that was a not so quick walkthrough uh, of my books that are poker related I have tons of books that aren't poker related but these uh, are my favorite books definitely so yeah uh, I'll see you guys. I'll, is it this way? I don't know. I'll see you guys around. <laughs> see ya.